because these last two pages gonna be my testimony. I just got the random idea to move the office around. Comment down below if y'all want me to start selling lashes. Like what? But this is not the color I was going for. If you shampoo your hair and don't wash your bonnet, did you really clean your hair? I know y'all see it. I know y'all see it. Y'all, I lost all of that footage. I'm doing these everyday vlogs because I can show y'all even with my walk with God, it's not just a straight shot, easy road. <laughs> Dang, I feel like every vlog I start off, I'm starting it off in a bonnet. <laughs> I've got to turn off my life. But um, what's up nation? It's your girl Risha Tane and I am back with another video. And today's Monday and it's like three o'clock in the um, afternoon. Y'all know I don't have a count of what weekly vlog on my own, but. So, um, I am currently writing this paper that y'all know about from last week. You know? So I'm currently writing this paper. I am two and a half pages in. I literally just posted this clip on my, my story. I'm two and a half pages into this paper. I started bull I started up. Uh, I'm two and a half pages in excuse me. I'm two and a half pages into this paper. To a four page paper. I started BSing halfway through the first page. How much more BS can I come up with? How much? Um, but he messed up putting critique and personal reflection as um one of the guidelines because these last two pages it's gonna be my testimony. <laughs> Fuck you thought. <laughs> Fuck you thought. <laughs> these last two pages it's gonna be my testimony. You thought you th <laughs> what you thought I was gonna do. <laughs> I was saying two and a half, but it's really one and a half. I have one full page and then a half of another page. So I have to finish that page and then do two more. If I had have had two and a half pages, then I would have only had to do a half of a page and another one. Okay, y'all. So it's 512 and I finished my paper. I'm about to run and go... Um, to the store really quick to get the stuff that I needed. Um, I'm hoping I don't miss the delivery guy or whatever because it doesn't say that it's out for delivery, so I don't know. Hopefully, I don't miss him though. But I'm gonna run and go do it because it's 5 12 and the place closes at 7, so I can go ahead and go do it. Also, definitely running out of storage on here. I don't know what the hell I've been filming, but I need to go buy another Sims car from Walmart too. Okay, so. Y'all know my washing machine loud. I'm back from the store and I need to add on to my schedule. I'm yeah, I need to add on to my schedule to um go to the bank tomorrow. My business debit card it hasn't been working. Like it hasn't been allowing me to make purchases or whatever for whatever reason. And I've also forgotten the pen. I've forgotten the pen to it, so I'm gonna have to go to the bank tomorrow. I got my Sims card, which I'm gonna need to literally switch on in like three seconds. And then um, still haven't gotten the hair delivery yet. So I don't know how that's gonna go. And um, yeah, it's almost, well, it's 6.30 and uh, I'm about to eat. And then I think the washing machine went off. I need to put them clothes in the dryer. Oh, I didn't realize that I forgot to go to my mom's house until I was back on my side of town. So I'm just going to go to my mom's house another day. Okay, so I just had a random bizarre thought because I'm actually editing and it's 922. I'm 43 minutes into the video and the well, technically I'm 43, 40, I'm about 35 minutes into the video because I'm about to delete some of this footage. And there's about three hours 
in total of footage and I'm about 30 minutes into it and I have trimmed it from I think it was five when I started but um I just got the random idea to move the office around and I'm trying to think if it's crazy or not So, I changed the room around. It's 1.49 in the morning now. I finished editing the video. And after I finish showing y'all the room, I think I'm about to go ahead and transfer transfer over, find the clips for um, the first week in the life vlog and transfer them over onto there. So I can go ahead and do that. But I completely finished editing the video. I just haven't edited the um, trailer yet. So, I still have to do that, but the video is edited. Who you know? So, y'all move the room around, and it takes some getting used to, but I love it like this because now my workspace is by the sign, by my backdrop, and I feel like that gives a better vibe. So, if I ever want to like take videos of my workspace or whatever, it literally looks like it's all cohesive now. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna show y'all. So let me explain. Like I said, it takes a little getting used to and it seems crowded now because my work table is here, but we have to keep in mind that the work table won't always be um, in the middle of the floor. Like the work table won't always be in the middle of the floor. Once I'm done making these wigs, it's gonna get folded up. I don't know if I'm gonna keep this here or not because I don't know. I don't know. Because I kind of don't want to put it over there because there's enough going on over here as it is. So it might just stay there so I don't have to worry about putting any decorations or anything. And um, I don't know when I'm filming. I guess I could write stuff on it. Like, you never know. But I moved the couches up to that wall. Y'all, it took a lot for me to figure this out. A lot of maneuvering around. Like, when I say I did a lot of back and forth moving around and stuff like that, trying to figure out like what I was gonna like, what fit the best, what float the best, like it took a lot. So, good morning, kids. So, today's Tuesday, walking into my new office, and y'all, like I love the way it looks in here. So, the um what's it called the um package the hair 
Now say my shipment status has changed. It was supposed to be, well, it was letting me, see, as soon as I turn the camera on, it was letting me track where the driver was. But then it says that the shipment status has changed. Maybe he here or something. I don't know, but he was just, he was just two stops away from me, from the house. So either he didn't got something to eat, stopped and got his lunch or something. Maybe he's taking a lunch break, but they finna get delivered. That's what matters. So, this is the plan, y'all. Cause I slick nearly forgot that I have to bleach the knots on the three closure wigs. And I also might as well bleach the knots on the little, cause I ordered a frontal to replace my birthday wig. Cause if y'all watch my birthday vlog, y'all know what happened to the lace. And if you didn't go watch the birthday, me getting ready for my birthday trip, uh vlog because you'll know what happened to my birthday week lace but um i ordered a replacement lace for that so i need to bleach the knots on that one as well so we're gonna have five wigs today so three i'm taking out five things five little whatchamacallit and i think i'm gonna put them on this side of the table yeah i'm gonna have them on this side so i'm about to line up all Dang, I'm glad that I didn't follow my toe. I'm about to line up all the things on the table. Y'all know how that go. And, um, ooh, I love the new way this office is set up. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. I have to, um, I have to do color the two 613 wigs. And then I have to bleach one wig brown. Put highlights in one. And then... I gotta figure out what lengths I wanna do. All right, kiddos. So my daddy probably gonna be calling me any moment now to do this um, invoice for him, but the packs are here. My Amazon order that wasn't supposed to be here till Thursday is here on Tuesday. Like what? We love Amazon Prime. So I'm finna set y'all up probably like right here. Oh, that's perfect. I forgot to check and make sure. What's this? Oh, she sent some lashes. Hmm. She sent some lashes. Oh, where I be? Comment down below if y'all want me to start selling lashes. So, I just remembered, hopefully she put the elastic bands in here because I definitely forgot to, yes. I forgot to check an X. Y'all, the lace on these is so bomb. Like, look at the lace. I'm blocking the light. Like, what? Stop playing. And then the knots. Ugh. Okay. So here go my 613 units. Y'all see that hair? Oh, this is about to be bomb. Look at that. My light box isn't in here. Oh, the light box ships shipped separately. Oh, I forgot I ordered these. These are um card holders for my business cards. Like something cute to sit on the desk. So this one holds your cards. I'll show y'all in a little. 
and then this one too so it literally opens like that this little piece here i'm gonna show y'all how they work in a second i filmed me working on my wigs on my phone like i do time lapse for it so i can make so i can make instagram reels i think i'm going to start getting into instagram reels over tiktoks or like just posting the Instagram reels that I make on TikTok because I like Instagram reels more than TikTok. I don't know, managing so many different apps is just too much for me right now. But um, so you literally just drop them in there like so and close it up. And then this one sits like this. And if I'm feeling really special, Anytime I take my cards to stores and ask them if I can sit them in there, I might get these little things so mine can stand out from others and they're not just the regular basic ones that, um, like the ones that I bought. So I don't know, we'll see. There it is. So, just a reminder of what it looks like. That's what we're making with this. And I found a TikTok of them of her doing that, but I think she she mixed it with something. I just don't know what, like developer. Cause like she took it out of the. So this is a TikTok. I don't know what she mixed it with. I'm gonna assume developer though. Cause I'm seeing I see a little peak of white if I'm not mistaken. So I'm just gonna assume she mixed it with developer. Okay, so here's the tea. It's 11 p.m. and I forgot to come back to y'all once I had um got ready to do the 613 wigs. Shoot me, or don't. But um, the point is, all of the wigs are currently deep conditioning now, and I wiped down i'm about to do my last minute like straightening up before i get ready to eat and call it a night um your girl is tired and hungry as i'll get out and my back hurts no lie so um yeah about the 613 weeks i don't know the 16 inch one i'm nervous about but i think it's just gonna look like it just got different tones in it and then the 20 inch one i just hope they're not gonna be gray like i hope they're gonna be like i don't know because it's really hard to tell when it's wet coloring for the krishan remake is not gonna look like her wig at all like like it may look like a variation of it like it's inspo because the color did not come out i don't know how that what did what she used because she showed french cognac but i don't know what she used or how she did it but I don't know the coloring is not going to come out like that though i know that it's going to be lighter than that but the color is still fire like it's going to look dope as i'll get out it's just not going to be the orange look that i was going for none of them are going to be the orange look i was going for because the remake that i did for my hair like um with the little peekaboo coloring it did not turn out orange um it actually looks more red than anything but i don't know what it is i can never get orange to pop up how orange is supposed to pop up on stuff so there's just something that i gotta continue to learn as a um as a um hairstylist or whatever and figuring that out but now i'm gonna go for real because i gotta pee and i'm ready to yeah, so wow. okay kiddos <clears throat> hi first time y'all have seen me without my bonnet on in days Hold on, I'm remembering that I need to set an alarm to remind myself to go pick up my brother from um, daycare. So, yeah. Hey. Um, I decided to get a look cute today. Let me show y'all what I got on. It's just a little, um, what's my college dress? But, uh, not this is lopsided. Yeah, anyway. It's just a little chill, simple dress. You know the vibes. You know the vibes. So, on today's agenda, you guys, let me show y'all what the wigs look like. I 
also opened up the windows today and I feel like it just opened up and brightened the space beautifully. But um this is what we're working with. I had to go this way because the lighting is kind of with the whatchamacallit open, but I've rinsed out the deep conditioner, so these are drip drying. This is um So yeah, as y'all can see, the color did not come out how I wanted it to. However, I think it's still gonna be a really nice wig, but this is not the color I was going for. And it damn near looks like this, which was done solely by bleach. So I just wasted three bottles of French cognac. But um, here go the 613 units. This one is mine. And I honestly don't know if I'm going to wear this either because I don't see myself with 613 hair on. Like, no matter how much I want to, I don't see it. <clears throat> I really do not see it. So, I'm probably just going to style this one and put it up for sale as well. And, um, yeah. Here's the other one. It's a little more tone than the other one is but yeah I really don't know what the color is looking like just yet still because they're not completely dry but today is pluck frontals day <coughs> so I'm about to um <coughs> excuse me I have seven frontals in total to pluck okay y'all so I just finished, I gotta sit y'all right there. I just finished doing, it is currently 449, and I just finished doing all one, two, three, four, five of the frontals. The only two I have left are the 613 ones. Um, so yeah, when I go to style them, I'm about to show y'all the hair on the flow. When I go to style them, um, I probably have to like, you know, do my little extra little touch up pluckings and stuff like that, but I got the majority pluckings done. And this it had to have it had to be like a baseline pluck or whatever. I could only do so much. Because I literally I also was using my hot comb for the first time today. But I lit I have to leave and go get my brother from daycare. They close at six. So they go to hair to all the frontals <laughs> on the flow. And when I get back, I'm going to have to, um, when I get back, I'm going to have to do the, uh, 613 frontals. And I was supposed to cook tonight, but I'm going to cook tomorrow. Yeah, I was supposed to cook tonight, but I'm going to cook tomorrow. And I think I'm just going to pick me up, pick up some, um, Southern Classic on the way to the house. I mean, on the way back from, um. Yeah, on the way back to the house from picking up my brother because that's kind of what I'm craving. So, yeah, I'm glad I get to be from underneath these lights for a little bit, though. Um, I can't believe I plunked five, plunked five frontals that quick. That was, that's dope. Okay, y'all, so. <laughs> Funny thing. I did not take my camera out at all. When I went into the store, I also just ate, so I'm not gonna immediately get back into work because I kind of just hit, got a wave of tiredness. But <clears throat> I wanted to show y'all the two dyes that I got from. Um, I might actually go ahead and dip dye the wig because that don't take too much energy. I got a thing of Cajun spice and then a thing of Sunrise Orange. I don't know how this is gonna turn out. Okay, y'all, so I ended up only using the orange sunrise or whatever it was called. So now I just have a bottle of um, Cajun Spice in my, um, whatchamacallit, but um, it doesn't look exactly like the Krishan wig. 
However, now I'm actually seeing orange. Before I wasn't. So we'll be able to get a better look at that when it dries. But now I'm gonna actually take my break, catch up on my text messages and all of that jazz. Yeah, I'm about to take my break, catch up on my text messages and that stuff, park with my battery on charge. And then all I have left to do today is, where is my notepad? All I have left to do today is sew those um, bundles into the wigs and I gotta figure out which wigs need to be sewn into. Okay, y'all. Let me just put y'all in the wardrobe. Like, I'm always looking around trying to find somewhere to prop y'all instead of quite literally putting y'all on the thing that I bought that props y'all. I also have my um, retainer in, so not too much on this light list. Okay. So, finish the unit. Okay, that was a little extra, but finish the Nikki unit. Just peekaboo, slight, slight. You know what I'm saying? Just some slight. Let's shoot for a 10 a.m. start tomorrow. Um, Cause I also have to go to the grocery store at some point during the day tomorrow. So, um, y'all, I keep staring at this weed because look how it's drying. Look how this weed is drying, bro. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. I also just want to say y'all that I realized this is something that I could really do like I actually really enjoy this like being in this office working on these wigs all day like I wasn't displeased at all about it my back is sore but that's what comes with being a hairstylist other than that like I really enjoy doing this and I can't wait till this can actually be something that I wake up and do like this is what I do every single day you know what I mean your girl, oh, it's shave. Ugh. They did it for horrible. I'll tell you that much. Oh, they did it Okay. So let's see what we're working with here, y'all. We got all of these pieces. But all of my backdrops are big. So there's a red, green, and blue here. And then look at this peachy color. Y'all know something else that I thought about too that I need to get for the um that I have to go and find for the photo shoot. Like I guess at Michaels or like I don't know somewhere where I can get fresh herbs or something. I have to actually put a day on my calendar to figure out when I want to come up with like um hold on because I really forgot that the family hour. For my cousin on Friday. Well, I didn't forget, but I need to make sure I didn't put too much on my schedule to where I'm not gonna be. Oh, okay, period. Okay, hey kiddos. Yeah, I know what the um flat hair means. I washed my hair this morning. Oh, that reminds me. Cause whenever I wash my hair, I wash my um sheets on the same day. Because I mean why get back in your bed dirty bed with clean hair and why get in your clean bed with dirty hair so i watch like they have to be on the same time but i'm gonna start off by making the hair oils so i'm gonna sit y'all over here and pop this up on here oh the wig dry too let me see how it looks now that it's dry are y'all gonna be able to see me yeah i think so and y'all know I do a time lapse. Maybe I should put y'all on that end. 
so I can see my sign in the background. Also, I don't know why I don't turn my sign on when I come in the office. I, like, I don't know why I don't be turning my sign on. But I'm gonna start doing it. to be on this side of the room that way my sign can be in the background and then I gotta prop up my other phone because I like to have uh y'all know I like to do time lapses so I need to prop this up because I want it to be I need to wipe the table off too with a Clorox wipe Okay, y'all, so I don't know when the camera cut off from y'all being able to see everything, but I'm done making the oils, and I'm about to get started on plucking. I took a little smaller break. I'm moving kind of slow today, but it is what it is. I don't know how many closures I'm going to, I set the down hall. I don't know how many closures I'm going to get plucked before I have to leave because I'm going to my aunt's house just to chill and hang with her and my cousin came into town too for the funeral so my cousin and his wife came into town so I'm just gonna be like over there hanging out I'm take me and my brother over there and just chill hang out with them for a little so I'm really not stressed and if I feel up to it when I come back home then I'll do some more oh I'm about to get started on it but these are the hair oils <clears throat> They up there now so once they um sit i'll um because i'm you gotta let it sit for at least 24 hours because of the herbs and stuff like that like it needs time to mix if it was just oils then it would be different but there's herbs in there too so you want to give them time to um sit in the oils but once it does that i'm gonna make bottles for me my mom well me and my mom and um we're going to be test dummies for the whole month of August. And then if they turn out, like if we don't experience any irritation and I'm especially a good subject because we all know I got sensitive skin and, and I'm just sensitive. So, um, yeah, if we don't experience any irritation or anything like that and it gives a good vibe, then I'll go ahead and bottle the rest of them. Um but I don't want to bottle them and then um and this will also give me time too because I think I'm going to go ahead and order some more droppers for um the bottles or whatever the extra bottles that I have I think I'm going to order some more droppers because I don't have enough like it's not enough we'll see I don't know but anyways it'll give us time to see if like it's worth it and then or if they're good or if i need to tweak the recipe at all or any or anything like that okay y'all so your girl does i need to sponge my hair your girl does her ditty so i have plucked all of the closures and the only two left that i need to pluck are the 613 wigs but um it's six o'clock now and I also had to remake ice. I need to put labels on these too, by the way. I had to remake ice because I put aloe vera in there just because like I was thinking and I was like, dang, I want, I want to try to put it in there and then forgot that I had made the labels already. And aloe vera isn't in the label list. So yeah, I had to take that out. Um, 
So the oil that I took out is literally sitting in that jar. The um, ice smells good, but I mean, it has so much peppermint. It has so much peppermint in it that like, it didn't have a choice but to smell good. It just smells like peppermint. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of the smell of the um, of hair crack, but we'll see. Hey, stinks. So I'm back home. Y'all know my washing machine is loud as I'll get out. But, um, yeah, I'm back home. It's damn near midnight. Like, literally 20 minutes shy of midnight. And, um, I'm about to, I was gonna go to bed. However, since I love to go to my aunt's house, and I'll be having to put my, my, I have to put my, comforter in the dryer for two rounds like my comforter got to be in the dryer for like three hours in order to dry for real because i gotta flip it in because it's thick so um i can't sleep yet anyway because it's on the second round now so what i'm gonna do i'm about to go put my sheets on my bed so they can already be made up and on the bed and then i'm gonna come back in here and i'm gonna pluck the two 613 frontals which aren't isn't gonna take like too too long anyway so i'm gonna come back in here plus the 613 frontals and then um vacuum close up the shop there go that tp in close up the shop i need to wash out those um wash my colleagues but there's dishes in the sink so i need to wash the dishes in the sink as well wash these take a quick why don't i touch that oil take a quick shower Take a quick shower. Um, you love this for me. And then um, by the time all of that is done, I would have been and put my clothes in the dryer as well because I had to wash my bonnet. Because if you put the same bonnet on, if you shampoo your hair and don't wash your bonnet, did you really clean your hair? Because why would you put a dirty bonnet on top of your clean hair? be rude yourself i had gotten the idea of what i wanted all of my photo shoot concepts to be so like how i wanted each like every scene basically i typed it up and i like even went detail so i'll give you an example one of them is get mom to braid cone rose on mannequin head and use it to demonstrate oiling the scalp with both oils focus shot and shot showing me with apron on so like showing me with an apron on putting the oil on the hair as if to signify i'm a hairstylist and then doing focus shot focus shots up close because what i'm talking about is the mannequin head that i have that has hair on it getting my mom to braid braid cornrows into it because i haven't taught myself how to cornrow yet getting my mom to braid cornrows into it and then um setting up the photo to make it look like it's an actual person so like i'm gonna try to make it look as realistic as possible um so people can't tell that it's a mannequin and then do focus shots up close of the hair oil bottle and showing me putting the oils in so like i did that like i typed those up and i have some things on this list i just can't think of the, like i I'll have to go through and think of any if i need anything else so actually i'm not going to go buy those photo shoot items tomorrow so i have on my thing to do some homework go to the bank fold clothes and practice my makeup so that's all I got um, on the list. And I got me buying my photo shoot props tomorrow. But I might not even go and do that tomorrow. I might do that like Monday or something. I don't know. It depends. Y'all, so this for the... Hold on. Because my bonnet should be dry by now. I don't know about the rest of my stuff. But the bonnet should definitely be dry. And I'm tired of my head looking like this. Now that I'm up here, I'll be able to, by the time I'm done telling y'all this, I'll be able to, um, that's how you put a bonnet on one-handed. Ooh, this feel good on my head. Cover my ears too, that feel good. So y'all, I'm only covering my ears because the one feel good on my ears, so my business. Let me set the vibes. Let me set the tone. I'm laying in bed. I'm laying in bed. Dang. 
I'm laying in bed and I'm watching Us Outsiders because I love Red and Little Bit. Like y'all know that already. Like I love that. If y'all, I love them. If you don't know, now you know. Like go watch my channel. I've actually sent my PR package before, and that's what I want to talk about. Y'all, look at this. I know y'all see it. I know y'all see it. Y'all, this is a. I had to let it focus on me. This is a random upload. Well, I don't like random upload in the sense of this has nothing to do with their PR packaging. This has nothing to do with PO box opening. Like, this is a regular ass day for a little bit, and she is wearing my wig. I mean, she is wearing my bonnet. Like, I actually, I didn't bring none of my phones up here. Neither of my phones up in here, but um, I actually posted it on my Instagram, like on my business page, and I was like, look who, look who I uh, spotted. And our bonnet, I'm going to have to send them the new products or whatever. And I decided to, because it is literally 1.45 in the morning. And I decided to turn on the camera and film it now instead of updating y'all tomorrow. Because I wanted to start catching like in the moment type things. Instead of waiting to fill y'all in the next day. But, um, yeah y'all, this just like really hit for me. Because it's just like, dang, like, I still, they still, like, because when I sent them a PR, I sent them both a wig kit. And neither of them have worn the wig yet, or, or at least from my, like, I haven't seen either one of them in the wigs yet. Um, however, I'm not really tripping on it because I knew when I sent it, like, what it was. Like, it, it might be one day where they randomly need a wig and they remember that they have it. Like, I'm not tripping on it. They might wear the wig, they might not. That's the risk that you have to take when you're willing to send your business, but... When I when I um sent that PR package, I gave I gained 200 followers off of my Instagram alone. I mean, on my Instagram just off of them opening up my packaging on their YouTube channel alone. And um so yeah, I'm not tripping off of that because I mean like my my logo is still like it's in another video. You know what I'm saying? So, I um was thinking about it and I was like, "Dang, what am I going to do because for, like, I was really thinking about it, and I was like, I can't afford to send them another wig that they may or may not wear right now. Like, I can't afford to do that. I can't afford to take that risk right now. This is looking more and more like a Krishan remake, for real, for real, the more I look at it. Like, it's looking dark here, but, like, it looks super, I don't know. I think this is, might actually be pretty close once I flat iron it. But, anyway, um, yeah, I just can't afford that right now. However, I was like, dang. I realized I could, like, I don't know why I was not thinking about it, but I could literally send them, um, everything that comes, like, I can send them everything but the, um, I can send them everything, dang, I'm, let me get it out. I can send them everything but the wig, essentially, like, I can send them a plug pack. I can send each one of them a plug pack, which is obviously the bonnet and stuff like that, like, y'all know that. I can send each one of them a mirror. I can send each one of them both oils um so hair crack and ice i can send both of them uh each one of those and then i was thinking too potentially going ahead and taking that risk and sending just one hot comb because i can't afford to send two but just sending one hot comb and that because they're going to share it anyway um because i haven't ever seen them use that however i think it's just just because they don't have it and they wear wigs very often and to have that and be able to touch up their hair like I think if they have it they would use it type thing and um anytime like anytime I see them use it on their video I'm gonna screenshot it and post it like so it'll be that type of vibe okay y'all so your girl is dressed she got her nails on I'm um, also oh, let me put my I'll take this one off of my thumb because it's a little too big But you know the vibes, you know the vibes, and then let me show you how to fit. Oh, I don't have the belt on, I don't have the belt on right now because I'm gonna have to use the bathroom. But I'll put it on just the sake of to show you how to fit because I'm gonna use the bathroom and get ready to go. But there we go. Y'all still can't really see the whole fit. That's terrible lighting. Let 
y'all still can't see the whole fit. But either, anywho, I put on my Chelsea boots with the gold heel because the buckle is gold. And then I kept the same necklace. I finally wore, wearing my MK bracelet that I bought from um, TJ Maxx a few vlogs ago. What is it on there? Must be from the um, tag. And then y'all saw the jewelry already, but the nails I'm loving y'all. I put on my lip combo. Brushed up. <coughs> Brushed up the brows. With um. Okay y'all, so. I gotta do this quick, but I just got the, I have my face cut off. I gotta do this quick, but I just got the sudden urge to check my wigs and see if I can do any better at bleaching or not. Cause I was looking on TikTok and I was like, wow, their lace looks a bomb. I think I need to go through and put the bleach on my frontals, like all of my closures and frontals again and make sure that it's really doing what it's supposed to do. So I think that's what I'm about to do. So yeah, I'm about to lay them all out on the table and then bleach them. And while they're bleaching, I'm gonna pluck the knots. By the way, it's 12.09 right now. But I really wanna get this done because I think my wigs will look even better for it. Okay, kiddos, so it is 1.34 and I have completely finished bleaching and toning all of the closures and frontals. So now they can drip dry overnight. I ended up not doing this one because I had, I um, like it don't need it <laughs> essentially. So I didn't want to ruin the them by trying to overdo it. But yeah, that's all that. It was something else that I was going to mention. Oh, when I style them, I know, I'm trying to make sure all my press-ons are still on. Y'all, I loved my look today. I also really love these press-ons. But, um, yeah, I wanna make sure, and I moved the, um, by the way, just so y'all know, this is how this ended up drying. I moved, I'm actually kinda excited to see this hair on me. Um, I need to sit in the, oh, that's what I need to start doing. Every day next week, I'm going to go sit in the sun. I'm going to go sit out by the pool because I need to start getting some color in my skin for this photo shoot because I don't want to be too pale. It's 1.38. I need to hurry up and go to bed because I want to be able to, I don't want to be dog tired because I got to get up at 8 to go get that, um, Y'all, I lost all of that footage. <laughs> that video was a waste of, editing that video was a waste of my time. No, it couldn't have been because it don't even have, like for some reason only the trailer is pop, like only the trailer is showing. And I thought it might have been because, because in order to put the clips for the vlog on my computer, I had to delete the clips that were used to edit this video. But I saved the edited video before deleting the clips. So I knew that if I, like, I would just go back to the edited video to find my trailer if I needed to. But, um, only the intro is showing on here as if the rest of the footage is corrupted. 
Let's hope I can get this done right or I'm going to be making a, a trailer while my family here Sunday. Which I'm still probably going to end up having to do. I'm probably going to be in here working a little bit. But um, I'm about to go to bed now. Put my camera battery on charge. It's 151. Now that I'm done reeling from the shock of all of that, I'm about to hit the sack. Okay, kiddos. So, hold on. I have my clothes on. Oh, let me show y'all. So it's about a. Uh, oh, I don't have my watch on yet. But it's 9:17, and I'm eating, warming up my pizza. Let me just pick a little red pepper flakes on it because let me show y'all really quickly i went and picked it up this morning i went and picked her up this morning um that little mark is from us carrying it but i'm not really tripping on it because i can either slap some makeup on there to fix her or um edit it out when i take pictures so i'm not really worried about that I had a great time yesterday. I learned so much. My cousin's wife is bomb as I'll get out. Brianna is so dope. And she knows a lot about hair and stuff like that. So she actually helped me figure out how I'm going to set up my website. And instead of having an option like I did in the past where when I order, like I did custom orders so people could order for me or whatever, or they could like put in a custom order and say, I want this particular color or whatever. I'm not doing it anymore. I'm literally going to be doing restocks. So like, um, I'm going to be doing on hand only, only whatever I have is what I have. So even when I drop my website, I'm not going to have bundles to start off because I don't have those on hand. So I'm just not going to offer, be offering bundles right now. I'm only going to be offering, um, wigs. I'm only going to be offering wigs. So, and when I have, um, when I've saved up and I can order some bundles and have those on hand, that's when I offer those. So um, I'm actually really excited to set my website up like that. And I wanted to do that, but I was worried that it wasn't the best idea for me uh, coming out and trying to get myself up. But it's really going to build that. Um, I don't know what the word is I'm looking for, but it's really going to build that. Uh, want for clients to be like, oh, this all, I can only catch up when I catch it. So I got to make sure I'm doing this. So, you know what I'm saying? So. Obviously, y'all can tell I'm getting more into wearing my rings every day. I love this. But, so there's that. She also helped me with understanding um, my faith and how I want to approach that. And I'm actually glad that I'm doing these everyday vlogs because I can show y'all even with my walk with God. It's not just a straight shot, easy road. You start reading the Bible and everything just gets better. And, uh, well, you know what I mean? Like, it don't. it's not always easy to do it. And no matter how many times I say I'm going to read the Bible cover to cover, I'm going to read every night or whatever. I always have my issues. But she was helping me and giving me advice last night, letting me know that I should try devotionals first. And, um you know do that every day instead of trying to read it cover to cover and that way it'll give me the opportunity to be able to study and um learn it better that way so i'm super excited about that she recommended me todd michael to start watching his um to start watching his videos so i'm excited to start doing that as well um i hope y'all enjoyed this video because i'm not i don't have anything else to do today so i hope y'all enjoyed this video um, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget we're on the road to 5,000 subscribers. And when we get there, I will be doing a $200 cash app giveaway. Y'all don't want to miss out on that. So, um, make sure y'all letting everybody know. Hit that subscribe button, okay? Um, stay tuned for next week. Oh, that's what I was going to tell you. I booked a consultation for a hair, like, I book, booked a consultation because I want to go brown like tired of the black i want to go brown especially while my hair is still short and it'll look how i want it to look so i booked the consultation and the only reason why i didn't just outright go ahead and book the color is because my um hair i dyed it jet black and i know that that plays a part in it so we'll have to like figure that out and all that jazz um so excited to cook because i want another smell in here other than that bleach seriously but um 
yeah anyways so i booked a consultation and it's on wednesday at 2 p.m my last appointment is at 10 a.m so stay tuned for that as well wow tomorrow i start styling all of these wigs the photo shoot is literally next week i have a lot to do it's crunch time now i also have a homework assignment to do tonight bye y'all see y'all next next video um i hope y'all are enjoying these vlogs comment down i don't know what i was gonna say comment down below an orange heart or something yeah comment down below an orange heart let me see them orange hearts in the comments um but yeah that's it like comment share and subscribe i love y'all nation it's your girl risha tonight and i am signing out